Okay, he was hoping for something less crappy. Picross 2. I did not know there was a Picross 2. <laughs> well, sure we can play a few puzzle games. Picross. I like the sound of that. Uh, yes, I would like a hint. That's a pretty good spot for a hint. Er, actually, that's not, but the bottom one is, at least. Let's see. Do some stuff. Okay. And for those of you who have no clue what I'm doing, uh, Picross. Oops. It's a series of puzzle games where the numbers tell you where the colored in blocks will be. So since it says 221, it tells me that there's two blocks in a row, and not three. So there isn't one there. Let's care about this. And this being the very first stage of this, it's pretty damn easy, if I actually pay attention, rather than babbling on for no real reason. It's all just a series of using logic and the clues given to figure out what goes where and uncover a hidden picture. Quarter of a picture in this case. But, oh, holy crap! We have access to the whole thing. That's interesting. I've actually never seen that done in a Picross game before. It's pretty cool. And stuff like 13 1 and 12 2 is always nice since, you know, it fills up the entire row, so there's no guessing whatsoever. Let's see, that's 7 and 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So does this. Always nice. And now we can fill in some of this stuff. Threes and twos and ones, and that goes there. It says, that goes there. And now we're back to making educated guesses.
Hmm. Let's see, that goes like that. Whoops. That does not go like that. Where does that go then? Oh, whoops. Reading the numbers would be really good. Oh, I really screwed up there. Where does that one go? There we go. background music we can listen to. Well, they all kind of suck equally. This one kind of sucks more than others. Oh, well, we are almost out of time there, so I should probably stop making blind guesses here. Tell am I done, or did I screw something up somewhere? Oh. Oh, there we go. May as well keep going. I don't know what the hell this thing is. Hmm. That's always lovely. Why did I do that? This has been lovely so far. I like puzzles that are half solved with two hints.
I kind of wish there was more to say here, but... Well, dang it. I should probably stop saying things, because then I stupidly screw up. <laughs> Not there. Almost done. Should be able to pull this through. Woohoo. Still don't have a clue what the hell this whole picture is. This section is coming together nicely. We're all very simple so far. I haven't screwed up once yet, so keep your fingers crossed, folks. Maybe I will soon. blind gas right there.
And that is... Kotori. What on earth could a Kotori be? I'm getting nothing from that picture. Oh, I think it's a bird. Yeah, like the uh, eyes right there and the little beak, a wing, a branch it's sitting on. Okay, I guess that works. So, yeah. That was definitely enough of Picross for probably the rest of this video series. Or at least until we get to the next other Picross games. <laughs> oh, it's slightly over. It's possible that if I hadn't screwed up so many times and taken less than an hour, we would have gotten some kind of animated picture to give us a clue, but... No, I am not going to do that again. That took far too long. Oh, that is... Let's see what else we have. Yeah, right. Wow. No, we can't move on until they're all done. That is way too many really huge Picross levels. What else do we have here? Easy Picross. Ooh, they're tiny. That is not tiny. You are lying to me, game. 